Hey everybody, what's up? Chad Wesley Smith here for Juggernaut Training Systems. Today I'm going to be talking to you about the best exercises to improve your deadlift. So take a second, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and here we go. If you're struggling off the floor in the deadlift, there's a lot of great options that can help you out there. Deficit deadlifts is a typical go-to, but the one that I'm going to choose today is what I call the Cohen style deadlift, named for the greatest powerlifter of all time, Ed Cohen. If you watch a video of Ed doing reps in the deadlift, he lowers the bar with great control, and then when the bar gets to the floor, he lets the tension out of the bar, but not out of his, not out of his body. This is gonna help reinforce great starting positions. You're gonna build eccentric strength, which is often overlooked in the deadlift. You know, as soon as you start doing these, you're gonna see how much more challenging they are and, and how much more time under tension it gives you in that, that low starting position of the deadlift and without resetting your hips or anything there. A lot of great benefits to this exercise, really improves technique, improves positions, uh, so the Cohen style deadlift is a great option to use hypertrophy or strength and then by the time you're in peaking you're probably doing mostly singles in the deadlift so it doesn't really apply as much then but don't neglect that eccentric phase of the deadlift as there's a lot of strength to be built there. The box deadlift is my next best exercise to improve the deadlift. And the box deadlift is just kind of a, a variation of the RDL that was shown to me by uh, Mikhail Kuklaev and, and Boris Sheko during a seminar that we hosted for them several years ago. Uh, and this is using a box or a bench or a vert pull device behind you, like pressed up against your calves, and that gives you the tactile cue to try and smash your calves into the box or bench or whatever you're using, and that keeps a totally vertical shin position throughout the lift and allows you to feel a lot more stress in the hamstrings, even using lighter weights. This is a great exercise for me to not only build my hamstring strength, but also improve the start position of the deadlift, my hinging pattern, uh, so it can help in a lot of, lot of ways. This is a great second exercise in a, in a strength or peaking phase to complement your competition style deadlifting, or it could be a main movement during a hypertrophy phase. My final favorite exercise to improve your deadlift here is gonna be the block pull. Block height is gonna vary maybe two to four inches, possibly as high as five or six inches if you're very tall uh, and particularly long-legged. Uh, but if you're struggling with a lockout, the block pull is gonna be the go-to there. Most conventional deadlifters will not be able to do as much off of blocks until you get into really high blocks. But if we're in you know, moderate block heights, most conventional deadlifters won't be able to go as heavy as they can from the floor. That's because the block pull eliminates any you know, leg drive that you can get and momentum you can generate off the floor. This was an exercise that I was way worse in, maybe 100 pounds weaker in than I was off the floor, and even though that's kind of counterintuitive. Uh, then including it, as that, start, as that number started to come up to be more in line with, with my regular deadlift, my lockout strength improved so much. It's a great uh, workaround. You know, if you're struggling with a little bit of low back issue that's compromised when you start from the floor, you can train from various height blocks to allow you to still get your deadlift training in. It's a little bit less fatiguing because you're not moving the bar as far and generally not using as heavy a weight for the conventional deadlifter. So this can be included in any phase as a primary movement in hypertrophy uh, or as a fatigue management strategy in either strength or peaking or just to address lockout issues. So those are my best exercises to improve your deadlift. Hopefully you learned something that you can take and use in your training. Visit jtsstrength.com to get our apparel, books, online coaching, and download the Juggernaut AI app to get totally customized programming for you for Apple and Android.